Well, we are just less than 24 hours from the opening of Orlando's tallest, fastest, and longest roller coaster. New Six's Kirsten O'Connor and photojournalist Tahir Lee took a test ride of SeaWorld's Mako coaster in the last few hours. Take a look here. We're ready to go. So uh, at least we're not going to be completely alone. We have a group of people here behind us who've already ridden this. They said we 10 times, it sounds like. So at least we can be with the pros. Let's do this thing, yeah? Let's go. Modeled after the Mako shark. They are the cheetahs of the open ocean. Here we go, okay. This roller coaster is sure to make you scream. If you're intimidated by this, just know it keeps going longer than any other ride in Orlando. No sex, baby. The beauty of having the, the brand new roller coaster ride here at SeaWorld, named after the Mako, is it's going to put the spotlight on this animal. Guy Harvey has been capturing images of the Mako shark both in his art and in underwater cinematography for years. It brings to light a very important uh, subject, and that's the loss of sharks in our in our oceans. Back up again! If you don't oh like the ups and downs of roller coasters, you do not want to do this one. Oh my I think we made, it. Yeah. we made it. That was intense. Definitely worth a round of applause. Mako roller coaster, unlike any roller coaster I've ever been on, and we are theme park junkies, so we're excited for all of you to try it as well. Stay tuned to News 6 for more. All right, Kirsten, thanks so much. Look like a great time. Kirsten says the full ride lasts about three minutes. You can watch her entire test ride on our website. Click right